Hello, I'm Chris Menard. The other day I did an Excel video taking a look at time in Excel, and I'll put a link to that video down below, plus it's up in the top right corner. That is where I dealt with 3 p.m. minus 9 a.m., how to make that work. In this example, though, someone followed up with a question for me about what do you do when you have 8 hours or 12 hours and 20 minutes 14 hours and 17 minutes converting that decimal to time. So here I go, really simple. I'm going to do it first for hours. Then I'm going to come back in column F and do minutes. I've got projects listed in column A. I don't care if they're projects, uh, staff, employees, whatever you're tracking works. Really simple. Eight hours, which is eight colon zero zero. You want to divide by 24, 24 hours in a day. You're saying that doesn't look right. Trust me, it is. I got the crosshairs. I did an auto fill. I'm going to go to format cells. Control one is format cells. You can also right click and go to format cells. Go to custom. Look at my sample 0 0.33. That's always the first one. I'm going to put an H for hours, colon, MM, 8 colon 0, 0 is now my sample. Click OK. Before I click OK, <clears throat> 3.25 and row 8. 0.25 is 15 minutes out of 60. So that should end up being 3 colon 15. I want to pay attention to that 30 hours below there too real quick just to show you this. Everything is correct, even though that 30 came out of 6 colon 0, 0 in row 9. It took the 30 hours, it subtracted 24, and said you did 6 hours the next day. But I want to show the 30, so here we go. Right click, Format Cells. I'm going to put an uh, open bracket in front of the H and a closed one after it. Click OK, and that 6 will go to 30 right there. So that's, that is that one. One last item is if you want to total these up, absolutely sum them up. 99 hours in 15 minutes. If it doesn't show that, remember the same thing I just did. Go back and make the H have an open and closed bracket. Here we go with minutes. 90 minutes should be 1 hour and 30 minutes divided by 1440. 24 hours in a day, 60 minutes in an hour, 24 times 60 is 1440. Let me change that number. That's the one that was throwing me. 125 minutes. There we go. This file will be available for download also. I forgot to tell you that. Look, same steps. Format cells, custom, H colon MM, and you know what? I might as well go ahead and do it the right way because that's how I want to see it. Hit OK. Let's test it. 90 minutes is one hour and 30 minutes. That's perfect. That should be two hours and five minutes. 120 minutes is two hours. There's the five minutes with it. Everything's working great. Again, I could come down here and total these minutes up. Anyway, I hope that helps with the hours divided by 24, minutes divided by 1440, which is 24 times 60. If you have any questions about this video or my other videos in Excel about time, I'll put a link to all of them down below. i got quite a few. Let me know. Feel free to subscribe. I appreciate your time. Have a wonderful day.